want to advise people, not my followers, it is at your discretion if you want to side with SCNC or whatever. But SCNC um, activist Shea Kiavo War Milim went online and told me and, and called my name in this video saying I'm against his views. Of course, I'm against anything SCNC. Of course, I'm against anything that brings division to people's lives. I'm against anything that brings division in Cameroon. Cameroon was already one. Cameroon is one. Even before we're colonized, we're one. Even after we're colonized, we're still reunited as one, although it was not signed. I am for one Cameroon. I don't stand and I will never ever support anything SCNC. SCNC is a self-determination group in Cameroon that is even illegal in the first place, according to, to the law. It is illegal. And their brothers made the ambassador of the U.S. come build plot, and we need a U.S. embassy in Boya. Once the U.S. embassy did it, because U.S. don't show say they did for a site. I don't know whether I want to write ambassador or not, but I want to tell you so make everybody go now, you go right for ambassador, say ambassador, thank you for supporting us, public of Ambazonia. Thank you for calling the word Ambazonia in the presidency of the La Republic du Cameroon. Ambassador, you open your mop, you talk and say charter. But of course, every other country in the world do not want people to break up. Even Hawaii in the US will not want to break up with the US or whatever. Obama will never allow that. I don't stand and I will never ever support it. Now my US friend tell me say. Can we even look the thing? He said, the next thing will happen, I say, U.S. does not support Ambazonia. And it nobody take me by surprise that when U.S. ambassador start support me. He said, when U.S. start support Ambazonia, the first thing I say, they go to the lobby for back, for make other countries that made a support Ambazonia. I don't want a Cameroon where people are dividing themselves or want to seek independence. No, I don't. The lawyers put up a genuine strike because they identified every Cameroonian along one thing, the Anglophone problem, and not along SCNC or CPDM or SDF or whatever. No! If they brought in partisans or party whatever or groups or whatever, people could have backed out. People came to side with the lawyers and teachers because they accepted that Cameroon Cameroon has a problem, the Anglophone problem. We are marginalized. At this stage of the struggle, U.S. They already show we say the day for we. Now, the only country that in the entire world since where the struggle starts, since where we start cry, since 1961, where they don't open up saying no. We don't look this thing fine. We say, no, these people, they get right for independence. How to get jobs, sharing links, saying that this is how we can live together. This is how we can dialogue. This is how we can come to the view of Cameroon I want. I want a Cameroon where people are free to express their views without oppression. Of course. He said, the first thing I said, when you as the listeners support a people, the next thing I said, all countries will not go to fall by U.S. He said the country they're going to talk about U.S. now because the U.S. gave money where U.S. sustain other people their own economy. So it's and because if you stay at home, allow other people to go out freely and open their shops. Allow them do your own things independently. If you're fasting, you don't need to tell your neighbor not to fast. Please, please stay at home. It's very simple. So tell these SCNC activists when you see them on Facebook, most of them have blind uh, apps. They don't have profile pictures. They, that's the first way to identify them. They don't have profile pictures because they come back to the country. They, they don't want the airports to identify them. If we talk, say, when the U.S. will start to support Ambazonia independence, ban wagoning effect will happen. That means say, all small, small countries, they go one join. Israel, go join. This one, go join. That one, go join. This one, go join. All those countries that go join for bad U.S., then support our independence, then pass an for law, and then you and now go recognize Ambazonia like the newest country in the world. I just say how... So please, stay at home. Please, and allow other people not to stay at home, not to, ex to exercise their rights freely. If you're going to strike on the street, simply walk. You don't need to be burning down tires and g g bringing down buildings. Simply just walk. When you see the policeman, carry a bottle of water and give him. Oh, bro, I bet they can drink some. If it be, how if it happen? He tell me, say, when I don't start on a very good footing, say, when I don't start with violence, I say, how? He tell me, say, last year, that time when I start that come, he didn't watch me, I should say, he didn't watch me, I say, you just walk. When you see the policeman, carry a bottle of water and give him. Oh, bro, I bet they can drink self-master, you don't try. 
Right now, yesterday, as of yesterday in Cameroon, there was a Boko Haram attack in the north. These are the police who are guarding us against Boko Haram. Now we are dividing the country. And these are the same useless SCNC activists wanting to divide the country. We are fighting Boko Haram in the north. People are there wanting violence on the streets. People are there, look at my post, most of them who come and say, no, they should go and fight, they should exercise, they, they should go and fight. I are mostly SCNC people. Even my friend, my very good friend for the page, if we tell me, say, last year, that's how we start, we start very peaceful. Say, they don't shit on, they don't look all our videos, what they do, and where tap on the door, money do, and where they say, no violence, no this, please, do not, when the police is attacking you, put your hands up, just use a peace plant. If to say, that was the best approach ever used. If to say, as we start and so with that particular approach, till this particular time, they will see them say, you as though she don't analyze them. Say, any human rights organization never should don't analyze them. So when they should not analyze, say these people have been peaceful and the leaders were preaching peace. They were saying that don't retaliate because they gave the, the fool a long rope to pull and hang himself. They want the country to divide. They have simply seen a good cause made by the lawyer and they are infiltrating now to, to bring it to the table. Because they know when the minister invites them in Yaoundé, they would now bring in the SCNC thing. No! No, please, Mr. Bia, my own president, my good president, please be watchful about this. Be watchful. The opposition leaders as well should be watchful. The teachers should also be watchful. The lawyers should be watchful. People are listening to you. You put up a very good cause, which I support because as a citizen, I support. I've, I've gone through my... Yes, we never retaliated. It just said that was exactly what every country should do. So you start with peace, then you transition now to self-defense. Just to tell the world that... Bia has every right to clamp down on SCNC activists who are seeking to divide the country. I have been saying it consistently, and I will say it for the sake of a winning struggle. I was at the center of all this. I will be this center. Now, I will. Now, me, I will stand for center. When they will want this, they will want broke everything. So that made they get all their crooked because me, I be straightforward.